and friends and protesters and trade unionists and environmentalists and senior citizens and teacher unions and auto workers. We thought we'd be safe up here. And now a year later I want to know who's responsible for making the decision to send the cops to Queen's Park. and the ones behind the scenes. That's a scarier punch. I want to know who made the decision to come up here and beat the crap out of citizens for doing their civic duties by protesting, by being able to stand up here and express what we are different kind of a government policy be implemented. But I also want to know what role did the Toronto Police Executive play in all of this? I want to know what did the role was the OPP playing in all of this? Yeah, yeah, the RCMP, what role did they play? Yeah, and the five or six police forces from outside of our province, what role did they play in the mayhem that ensued a year ago? And the only way we can get to that answer, my friends, is to keep the pressure up the way we are today, the way we've been this past week. But above all, above all we have to say to the chief of police, in this city, you let us down, Chief Blair. Yep. You did not protect the citizens right. of this community, right. Chief Blair. Yeah. You were behind the scenes, yeah. Chief Blair, covering up for those cops who beat the crap out of our citizens. Yeah. And we know that the code of silence that you have engaged in has prevented the special investigation units from finding out what went on behind the scenes. 